definitely a roller coaster ride yes, of temperatures. Are. That's mm -hmm. for sure. Yeah, it was cold yesterday. Going to be another chilly day today, but tomorrow we're right back up into the mid to upper 60s. Good. Uh, right. And as we get towards uh, Wednesday, Thursday, big travel days, of course, of Thanksgiving yep. coming on up. And weather, you know, throughout the entire country looks pretty good. Mm -hmm. Not too bad at all. We do have the risk of a few showers here early on in the day on Wednesday, and that'll be about it, clearing out quickly as the storm system moves offshore. All right, chilly start to the week, as we talked about, and that brief warm up in store for tomorrow in the mid 60s. Holiday travel, uh, not too bad either. Thanksgiving itself dry, sunny and cool. 41 right now at the airport. Always one of the warmer spots because pretty much everywhere else is low to mid 30s, even a few upper 20s on the map. I'll show you in a second. 31 Surrey to Husky right at freezing in Chesapeake. We're 28 now Gatesville and West Point. 36 Hampton, 41 Wachapree and 36 in Elizabeth City. High pressure to our west today, driving our winds and out of the northwest. We saw the similar setup last week and this moves fairly quickly east and offshore. Once that happens, our winds change up out of the south, which is why tomorrow will be significantly warmer into the mid 60s, but it doesn't last too long. 59 on Wednesday and behind a storm system that will exit off the coastline around 50 or so on Thanksgiving. It will be sunny and dry though, so that's some good news. Here's travel weather for Wednesday. Biggest travel day of the year up and down the eastern seaboard looking all right. Not indicated here are a few shower chances early on in the day with a storm just offshore. More showers down towards Florida. Nation's midsection here. No real issues until you get well north up towards Minneapolis. Could see a little bit of snow there. Pacific Northwest as well dealing with some rain showers with the storm that's uh, coming on shore likely on Tuesday in the Seattle area. Thanksgiving here in Hampton Roads. 50 degrees, partly cloudy, chilly, but dry out there. Temperatures running a good 10 degrees below average for that date. Here's how it shapes up today. Plenty of sunshine across the entire area, but with winds out of the northwest, having a tough time really warming up a lot in the low to mid 50s. Tonight, another cool one, but our winds start to shift out of the south. And after a cold start tomorrow, we'll see that sun and those southerly winds pushing our temperatures into the mid to upper 60s. A few high clouds begin to filter on in, those lower and thicken Tuesday night. And we see the risk of a few showers overnight in a very early Wednesday with that storm just just offshore 34 54 today, mostly sunny and chilly northwest winds and over to the southwest uh, late tonight. We drop back to 38, so cool overnight with clear skies and then eventually warming things up nicely tomorrow An increasing cloud shower chances overnight. I don't think it's talking a washout or anything like that. Early in the when early in the day, Wednesday a shower or two and then clearing skies Thursday itself. Thanksgiving 50 partly cloudy back in the 60s by Saturday.